Hello everyone, this is the story of Blastocystis hominis and the most important question is Blastocystis hominis is pathogenic or not? Let's see. Once upon a time, a man felt abdominal pain and flatulence. Stool examination of this man revealed the Blastocystis hominis. However, it was only 0 to 1 per field. By the way, Blastocystis hominis is the commonest intestinal parasite found in the human stool samples. The patient went to Dr. Walid, a tropical medicine specialist, who opened an investigation record and accused the Blastocystis hominis of these symptoms. <clears throat> Open the investigation record. What's your name? I am Blastocystis hominis. Where are you living? I'm living in large intestine. Give me your ID. Here you are. Oh, okay. You changed your family from protozoa to straminopella. So, you are accused of causing digestive troubles to my patient. I am innocent. I didn't do anything. You have a lawyer? Yes. Dr. Noha, the parasitologist. Dr. Noha, what is your opinion? Is blastocystis pathogenic or not? Blastocystis is commonly asymptomatic. However, it can cause digestive symptoms. Also, it is more found in inflammatory bowel disease patients and irritable bowel syndrome patients. Recently, it is reported with arthritis and allergy. Also, it, was, it wasn't associated with any other parasite, however, it was only 0 to 1 per field under the microscope. What's your opinion, Dr. Walid? Okay, uh, because the patient is suffering and as we can't accuse any other cause, so the decision is that blastocystis hominis in that patient is guilty, it is pathogenic. And the patient will take metronidazole, 750 milligrams, Three times daily for five days. Thank you, Dr. Noha. Thank you, Dr. Walid. I am sorry, blastocysts. I tried. And this was the end of the story of blastocysts hominis. Thank you for listening.